Steve Hoskins taking on Dave Watka here in the championship match of the Greater Detroit Open. Hoskins looking for his 10th PBA Tour victory, certainly a milestone, and Watka wants to get that first tournament victory, which means a spot in the Brunswick World Tournament of Champions in a couple of weeks. Hoskins with just the eight pin standing and certainly could have been worse. The two, the four, and the five crumbled out. Won't be 300 for Hoskins this game either as this ball comes in very light and really happy just to see the eight pin standing. He might hook at this. He does. Brings it back, so it's fair to start the championship match for Steve Hoskins. Now, Dave Wadka, a guy that you say, hey, should win, if not tonight, should win very soon. A guy who you would have thought would have won earlier in his career, going to throw the ball straighter than Hoskins. Boy, smooth stroke. Well, he's got a beautiful game. He really does. And then, uh, you know, I don't know if you say that maybe he's underachieved in his, in his first uh, 10 years on tour. Watch the ball come in strong. Power strike, knocks them all down. It's Keeps nice, himself fit. Yeah, nice way to start. Uh, yeah, but def definitely stays in very good shape. Now that ball surface. Allow the ball to go down a little bit before hooking. Made it go down a little too far that time. The ball comes in light, leaves the two and the eight. Take a look at the Dobbins, Ted and Leona, the other co-proprietors here at Taylor Lanes. What a great week once again. Coming here for 15 years. The pros. It's a difficult spare. Look out. No problem. Takes care of the two and the eight. And really, a couple of milestones you said earlier, the 10th the title, double figures, something that Steve Hoskins wants so desperately, and that first title for Dave Watkins. Hoskins up in the second frame after opening up with the spare. Ten pins for Hoskins. Johnny's got to be saying, why didn't he do that for me? Yeah, right. Last <laughs> night, the last game of match play, as we see the ball coming, just a little light. The six is going to lay in the channel. Doesn't quite get out. Lisa, Steve's wife, called up uh, Billy Yinger, Steve's ball rep, and I uh, want to know how he's doing. He was in the middle of shooting 300. Lisa stayed on to the very end. <laughs> Picks uh, it up. Just barely touches it. Hoskins, couple of spares. This is just, he, the air knocked this down. Just knocked it, just touched it. No big deal. Safe. Steve's children, uh, Lindsay and Ryan, I'm sure they're back in Florida watching Daddy Bull right now. And all excited. Still another 10 pin for Hoskins. Well, if Dave Watka wins tonight, he will be the seventh player to win his first title this year. Now, last year, no first time winners on the PBA Tour. The last time there were seven new champions on the PBA Tour in 1993, Steve Hoskins. the 10 pin once again finds himself two pins down to Dave Watka. Hoskins wondering why the ball won't carry and I think Watkins pretty well knows what happened to his last shot. He just made a bad shot and went for 2-8. Struck in the first frame on lane 40. Ring and 10. 
lead down to one pin, and all of a sudden, that strike fest has uh, taken a sabbatical. Dave and his wife Laura expecting their first child in about seven weeks, and he goes to an unusual looking ball. Another spare ball, Polyester should hook, picks it up. Watka now up in the fourth frame. That's a solid shot for Dave Watka, second strike of the game. Keeps that lead at one pin. Steve Hoskins looking for his first strike after uh, well, last game when he threw eight strikes in a row to start the game out. Still been in the pocket, just not able to carry a couple of corner pins. <laughs> Got to be saying, well, that looks familiar. Doesn't look good, but it looks familiar. Hoskins trails by two here in the fourth frame. The lanes change so much quicker in today's game than they did even just a few years ago when I was still bowling full time on tour. Picks up the 10 pin spare. Hoskins, the PBA Rookie of the Year back in 1989. And, and you know, I talked about Lisa's watch. Pretty, pretty solid performer. Uh, Monday Night League, Lee, congratulations, Lisa. 809, four games. She averages about 180. I'm impressed. Yeah, well, I'm not going to take her on. Yeah. <laughs> so two-pin advantage, but Wadka working on a strike now. In that fourth frame, Hoskins up in the fifth. Takes all the approach. First strike for Steve Hoskins. This game didn't come until the fifth frame. This is a little more like what he's been trying to, to get accomplished. Well, Marshall, you certainly know we got to get back a few years when you won your first time. But for Wadka right now, oh, there's no greater thrill in the game. That needs to hook hard. Two, four, eight, ten. That ball off to the right. Let's take another look at a Dexter footwork of the pros. Dave Watka has early timing, and he prefers to use the number two heel and the number four sole to control the length of his stride. The heel stops him and allows his hand to do the work, but his hand didn't do quite enough work on this last shot. He's going for it. It'll be just eight out. He's going to have to regroup right now. That's another Dexter footwork of the pros for Dave Watka finding himself 12 pins in the rears. Came close, but uh, just hooked by it a little bit. Talk about Dave's wife, pretty good bowler. Dave.